In the Bible, it says, you will know the truth, and the truth will make you free. That's in John 8.32. Well, free from what? Perhaps from ill health, perhaps from sickness, perhaps from that general weakness where we don't feel in our body temple a sense of well-being. If you think about and if you believe in the healing life of God, you concentrate on a divine strength. You know that the Lord is the strength of your body. The Lord is the strength of your life. And you have faith in the power of God within you and the power of God to heal you. Just as God created you in nine months' time, which is a miracle. Anybody that looks at a baby, even a doctor or a nurse, can admit, how can this be? It is so miraculous. It is so wondrous. Well, God can also create new life in you through a regeneration of your cells. Now, we know scientifically this is happening all the time. Well, God can direct this regeneration, rebuilding of you, and from the top of your head to the bottom of your feet, you can be made new. In God, you are whole, you are vitally alive, and you're able to accomplish all that your heart desires. If you think about and believe in God as your supply of health, you also know that God will give to you and supply your every need in life, that God will take care of you. You give willingly, generously, and joyfully as God always, constantly gives to you. And a good fortune that is without limit follows through your hands and life. And you are supplied with abundant prosperity. If you think about divine love, and if you believe in God's love for you, everywhere present, ever active, ever fulfilling, that you are loved, and therefore you are loving. Divine love through you creates wonders and miracles and blessings. If you think about and believe in the truth of God, and your life is filled with health, wealth, beauty, joy, and harmony, you know the truth that God is divine love, infinite life, and you're all in all. Bottom line, God takes care of you. Bottom line, God will supply your every need. Bottom line, God is with you, and you cannot be anywhere ever where God is not. So today, I ask you to look to God and make God your partner in life. And you'll find out that you can do great things, greater than you ever dreamed possible, because of God.